Hey everybody, today we're gonna to show you how to zero your optic using your SightRite 2.0 bore sighter. A lot of the times we get asked, why do we need a laser bore sighter? Well, in our opinion, it helps you get a faster zero on paper. Some ammo can be expensive, so this helps you save ammo while trying to zero your optics. Plus, it saves more ammo for shooting. So what comes in the box? SightRite 2.0, one battery, five adapters with screws, an Allen wrench, a screwdriver, and a set of instructions. Please make sure you have all that. The adapters will fit from 17 to 50 cal. With this kit, you have pretty much all the calibers you need. Just swap adapters to swap calibers. To begin, you should make sure the sight right laser is zeroed. It comes zeroed from the factory, but if it's not, it's an easy fix. Don't forget to remove the sticker at the tip of the laser to access the screws. Just tighten or loosen the screws at the front of the laser to center the laser with the Allen wrench. Remember, it doesn't need to be perfect. It just needs to be in the center and please make sure the laser is off when doing so. Now let's use the SightRite 2.0 to zero your optic. This can be done indoors, outdoors, it doesn't matter. As a general rule, we recommend zeroing at 25 yards, then adjusting to whatever you want, 25, 50, 100 yards. But with all that being said, let's get down to the zeroing process. Make sure to clear your firearm to ensure it's safe. For added safety, we recommend removing the magazine as well. Now, you're gonna to wanna to set up your rifle wherever you plan to sight it in. From there, turn on the laser and choose the correct adapter. Mine's a 308, so I'm gonna choose the second smallest adapter. I'm gonna screw it into the sight right and then insert it into the barrel like so. You always wanna eliminate as many variables as you can. When zeroing, always make sure the button of the sight right is facing up when in the bore. Keep in mind, the tighter you screw in the adapter, the more it will expand, giving you a snug or a loose fit. Once that's in, you're gonna to wanna to look through your optic and align the optic to the laser. After that, take out the laser and fire off a live round. Make your final adjustments if needed. And that's it. For storage, remove the adapter from the bore cider and keep it in the original packaging. You can keep it in your range bag, a backpack, doesn't matter, whatever you like. Lastly, thank y'all for your support. If you wanna reach out to us, you can find us on Facebook or Instagram at Tactical Elites or our email at support at tacticalelites.com.